This is Darshana Gauchan for B2B Cambodia with your market update for May 6, 2024. Starting off this week, the Cambodia Securities Exchange was down by 2.49 points or 0.61% to 408.8. Trading volume was low at 207,251 shares, changing hands at a trading value of around 261,000 US dollars or 1.06 billion Khmer real. Like Friday last week, Grand Twins International saw the largest percent gain today, up 30 real per share or 1.29% to 2,350 real per share. In contrast, Aklida Bank PLC stock saw the largest percent loss, down 2.37% or 180 real per share to 7,420 real per share. Mengli Jaquach PLC was down once again by 1.35% or 30 real per share to 2,190 real per share, a sign of profit taking given the recent rise in the stock. The Sienekville Autonomous Port stock also saw a slight drop by 0.16%, while most other stocks saw some percentage increase with the exception of Phnom Penh SEZ PLC and the Phnom Penh Water Supply Authority, which remain the same. In other economic news, Mekong Strategic Capital published at the end of April a report breaking down the latest rebased figures for Cambodia's GDP, published in the IMF's World Economic Outlook report based on a rigorous reassessment conducted by the National Institute of Statistics. The newly rebased figures show Cambodia's GDP is just over 35% larger than previous GDP calculations. The big difference in these calculations, according to Mekong Strategic Capital, is due to the new estimates using 2014 as the base calculation year, while previous estimates used the year 2000 as the base, and the Cambodian economy certainly looked very different 23 years ago. For that reason, the previous GDP estimates did not properly reflect the major transformations the Cambodian economy would undergo. What impact will this rebasing have? Well, the report concludes that it will mostly be around perception, but positive impacts of a change in perception include fall in high private debt to GDP ratio, even lower public debt levels, and an increase in GDP per capita by around 35%, putting Cambodia around five years closer to achieving upper middle income status. Moving on to the exchange rate, Khmer Real to USD rose to 4,072, with the US dollar index hovering around 105.09. Brent crude oil fell ever so slightly to 83.59 US dollars a barrel from last Friday, while gold rose to 2,325.6 US dollars an ounce. Dow Jones Industrial Average futures rose 30 points, or around 0.1%, while S&P 500 futures were 0.1% higher and NASDAQ 100 futures were flat. This was Darshana Gauchan with your market update for May 6, 2024.